Hello and welcome back to DSR Gaming. My name is Daryl and this is episode 18 of our Assassin's Creed of Valhalla playthrough. We are currently here in Westbury trying to find Eva. So we shall uh, carry on with that. Um, before we do get started, please make sure to share, like and subscribe if you do like the content. Uh, we do playthroughs on many other games and Pokemon has just come back between the four of us. And we are very close to uh, 60 subscribers so if you do like the episodes please make sure to uh, subscribe and support the channel right let's get into this now then Threat your wings, Sunan. we need to go over there by the looks of it so let's go over there then and this dude wants to hurry up So, smell that jailbird. Here he is. Eivor, jailbird. Hey, Eivor. I was telling the Aetherlink here that Thor is with us this day. Our victory is assured. So, what is your plan? That bastard Anir commands this hamlet. So let us show these folks what happens when a village bows to the Britons. Smash it to kindling, burn it to ashes, and cut Anir's tender throat. Right, my boy? I hope to fight well, not cruelly. The cutting of throats I leave to you. Flames and smoke will warm Rodri's desire for peace. Anir is a lesser concern. Peace is for suckling babes, but as you like. Oh, my blood runs hot. Let us rush in now and leave a trail of bloody kindling. A stealthy approach might earn us more time. Ah, I prefer sound and fury, but do as you must. I want to go in quietly. No point bringing every armed Briton down on our heads. Am I to stand here drooling like a village idiot waiting for your success? Chelbat, listen to this old man's stories and wipe his drool for him. I am not a patient man, Eivor. Put these dogs down quietly, or I may just join you the way I did in Lerichester. Okay. Who else we got up here? Well. Okay, go down here. Get off me. Get out of my face. See you later. I like that they've got fire pretty much everywhere. Who's <laughs> trying to fight me? Come on, let's go. <laughs> See you later. Alright, where else we gotta go?
Any more for any more. don't care about these uh, army because all I've got to do is this which is dumb I've got to kill the men anyway okay cool How did I go through him? There we go. Get out of my way. He's firing at me. No, I want loot, thank you. Where is he? Oh, here we go. Of course he's got a spear. Get out of my way so I can kill this dude. There we go. We now got to kill up his dudes. You'd think someone that leaders just died. Maybe everyone else would die as with them. They'd run away. Get this dude up, revive him. Come on, mate. Just give up already. There we go, one. There we go. He's gone. Stomp him. Doubles. What? You get wrecked. We'll go up here now. No, that's the last of them. Let us get a good view of our handiwork, Jailbert. Join us, Eivor. I knew that was going to happen. Oh, let's go in sneakily and then uh, they join us anyway. It always happens. Where are they going? Look here! Look upon this masterpiece! Eivor! Did you see Chilbert fight? He is all balls now! I give thanks for victory, and ask penance for taking lives. Ah, oh, Chilbert, your god <laughs> bores me to death! Have a laugh! We won! And I took no pleasure in it, Ivar. 
Eivor and I were made for this, my boy. The song of swords, the blood mist, the bone crunch and baring of teeth. To survive a battle is to be born anew in blood and streams. My father died in the snake pit. Left nothing but moldy bones and putrid flesh. But by the gods, he had earned a place at Odin's table. Your father, Ragnar, left a strong saga. Tjelbert, I would know your mind on all this. Are you satisfied with our victory? I... I believe I am. I'll need word from Rodri as soon as possible. What does he intend? He will see the flames. He will know Esbury has been destroyed. The bleeding pus pit claims only a dragon can defeat him. We will soon put that to the test. It is peace we want, Ivar, not revenge. If you cannot accept that, return to Repton now. You do not know Rodri as I do, Eivor. You do not know what a slippery, lying shit he can be. Enough talk of killing. <laughs> I need a moment of calm. You need mead. No, Ivar. True calm. A walk in the woods to clear the air. Or... fishing. Would you go fishing with me? Fishing, huh? What? Looking for a warm puddle to dangle your worm in? I saw a small pond nearby. Will you come? We can all take a moment to allow our blood to cool. Why are we fishing? No one cares for fishing. It's just up here. I have no fondness for fishing. Where Jesus, the Chalbert. Sporting? There's no chance the fish. Someone's supposed to be a leader. He really is a. Yeah. Here will be good. Let's fish for eel. Dale has relishes nettle soup cooked with eels fresh from the water. I will not fish. You go ahead. Look at all those delicious fish. That took longer than clearing this village. <laughs> we caught some eel for a feast. The bishop should be pleased. The simple fellow comes now. Ah. A strange way to celebrate victory. But then again, our Christ was a fisher of souls, was he not? Bishop, greetings. We've the makings for a delicious soup. I'm grateful, Chelbert. But my heart is heavy. So many homes burnt. We'll be years rebuilding. You should have seen Chelbert fight. He will be an elderman with sack and guts, fearsome and raw. I should rather be fair and just, but I take the compliment. I have sent word to the Britons. I pray King Rodri will again be open to peace, in spite of his brother's murder. It worked in our favor. Look where we landed. Britons begging for mercy like whiny pups. We set the village ablaze, yes. But peace is not guaranteed. And it will take another sort of skill to win it. Restraint. Our next steps are critical, my lords. And after what happened in Quatford, it is clear to me that Eva should lay low. Lay low? After all I have done here, you tell me to dunk my head? The good bishop is right, Eivor. You have a warrior's heart, not a peacemaker's. Fuck you, Wolf King. <laughs> I know Rodri, and I know the kind of tricks he will pull. That is me warning you. If you hear me farting, that is my welcome to the bastard. He bruised his pride, Eivor. If you have some balm for it, by all means, share it. His pride makes him difficult, and his anger makes him hasty. But he is not without honest feeling. I will hunt him a great boar, I think. And together we'll roast it over a fire and tell tales of war. That should please him. Bishop, we must prepare for Rodri's arrival. Rally our men and set up a camp just here. All right, let's do this. Peace or war will be decided, but not yet, not now. We must wait. I loathe waiting. It is all in God's hands. We can but pray and give thanks for this moment of rest. 
The Britons have come! The moment has ended. This way, by the Great Oak! Where is Chaelbert? He ought to be present for these talks as our future elderman. He went hunting. For wild boar, he said. That was quite some time ago, no? We cannot wait. We should settle the peace now. Who is Lady this? Lady Angharad, greetings. We come to speak of peace. We are glad and to hear it. But where is your great king? He stays at the castle at my behest. I feared his presence would inflame the cutthroat Ivar. We have confined our cutthroat to his tent. Both of us fretting over our war-hungry companions. It seems we are of the same mind. A surplus of caution never did any harm. I count this as a blessing. Perhaps then at long last we can end this war. Our peoples have suffered enough. And your proposal? We shall withdraw all our soldiers to the time-honored border of our lands. We ask only that you give us some days to collect our furnishings and leave Kausto Castle. In return, you pledge to end all hostilities as of this moment. These terms are generous. We have a truce. Truly. For how long? Be, this is well and quickly done. God go with you and your king, Lady Angharad. I salute you all. You waged a good war. Let us now wage a lasting peace. I stand bewildered, Eivor. In the blink of an eye, years of blood and sweat are put to an end. You have walked a difficult road, Bishop. Chaelbert must learn the good news. Will you tell him when you see him? I'll find him now. Uh, Chaelbert. Let's have a look at where he is. Oh, it's over the other side. He's in his tent. Where in Hellheimer has Tailbat gone to? Or not. Someone here must know. Okay. Speak to the guards. Uh. Oh, these dudes here. Okay. Have you seen Chaelbert? I don't keep track of the comings and goings of the Arderling. Ask another. Alright, mate. Chill out. It's only a question. I'm looking for Chaelbert. Have you seen him? Last I saw, he was sharpening arrowheads. Ivar, it is done. Peace, eh? And now everyone is shitting themselves with happiness. If not happiness, then relief. Have you seen Chelbat? Want to pass on the good news? He asked me to go hunting earlier, but I am in no such mood. Hmm. Hey, Eivor. Have you seen Chaelbert? My brother saw him last. <laughs> Strong as a mackerel, isn't he? Celebrating the peace. Got started early. Wake up! Huh? Where is Chaelbert? Chael... <coughs> Bert? Did none of you see Chilbert? Only him, Drenger. You will have to wait until he sleeps it off. Ah, I need to increase my charisma. No. How long before he's fit to speak, would you say? A few hours should do it. Unless you find another way to rouse him. Must be some way I can wake this drunk. Hmm. 
How do we get him woken up? That is the question. Is there any water or anything around here? I can just pour on him. Ivar, it is done. We always Beats, done that pit. Eh? Not happiness. Then yeah. Surely. Hmm. Oh, I know. I know what we can do. This is what we're going to be doing. I'm going to drop him in the water. See if this works, huh? Right over here. That's what I thought. Nice nab. That's a low thing to do to a man. <laughs> I am looking for Chilbert. The soft Saxon boy? The next elderman, yes. Said he was going hunting to bring back a feast for Ivar and the rest. I know he went hunting, but where? Round the mouth of a cave nearby. Follow the stream up the mountain. South of here. That's enough to go on. Thank you. Up the mountain. Okay, that over here then. Okay. Let's get going. So I knew that would work. Love it. Get over this mountain, shall we? I need some of this. That'll do. We'll go this side. This is the stream. We keep following this. I think I've fallen down there before. Is that picking up? There, huh? Okay, okay, okay. Okay. This is why. Comes a lot of good handy tips there. Love it. Otherwise, I would be going miles away from where I actually need to go, so that's good. Always like to check that, first of all. And then we'll probably be down here somewhere. Let's see you, old friend. So we look like we're in the right area. Whereabouts? Down here, maybe?
Oh, and drop down. There you go. What happened here? This doesn't look good. What is going on here? There's blood. He can't be dead, can he? Surely. Oh no, it's a deer. This way? That's not what I wanted to do. We knew there'd be walls around here. Line him up. There's something here. Paw prints and blood. Not from a boar. A wolf dragging something through the dirt. <laughs> okay, he's gone in here to hide. Tears of Freya. Jailbat, you live. Just? I. Uh, Stay quiet. You're badly hurt. What's that for? Dragon on the hilt. Guards, the Briton crest. Keep breathing, boy. Oh, you haven't got long. I will take you back to say your goodbyes. No. I can get you to the others. I'll go easy. Chairwork's gonna die. Save your strength. Oh, okay. Okay, I get it. I get it. Or not? I don't know. No? Is there another way? It's got to be the way. Surely. Uh, throw him. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Poor Chalbert. He's a goner. You'll let me through. No, what, what are you doing? Oh. 
Oh, that... Why am I stuck? I don't get it. Why can I not get through? Let's look up there. Poor child, but again, he went on his own. It's his own fault. Look, get off my face. Damn wolf. I don't think he's going to survive somehow, so... Some help here! Viva! Down him! By the hand of Thor! Is that the other? Hmm... Eivor! What happened? No! No! You foolish boy! What did you do? I found him deep in a cave beset by wolves. Ivar. Easy, boy. Easy. E... Ivar. Get me an axe right fucking now! Ivar. He's gone. An axe! His god will take him as he is. Axe or not. Go to your god, boy. And I will sing for you in Valhalla. This was no wolf. Tell me what happened. The Britons did this. I found this blade in his chest. A Briton's dagger. Rodri! But why? You murdered his brother. Did you think he would let that lie so easily? I told you he was a trickster. Peace was never his goal. He takes blood for blood. Bishop Deolam, over here. The walls of his fortress will not protect him. I will sheet this dagger into his lungs. We must move fast then. Attack before Rodri can revel in his trick. No mercy this time, Wolf Kissed. You spared that wet turd Leofrit. We will not spare Rodri. I swear. Lord above, what's happened? Chaelbert! Murdered. May the Lord who frees you from sin save you and raise you up. Send the boy's body to his father. We will want the Christian burial. Lady Angharad said Rodri is holed up in Kausto Castle. That may have been a lie or a tiny slip. By the way, we should find out. There is a spot near the fortress to set up camp. We will scout it together. Damn straight we will. Let's just go. Plan. We go now. Fine. And remember, leave Rotary to me. Is that the other? 
Hmm, poor, poor chair, but as soon as he went off in his own, I was like, yeah, he's got to be done. Got to be done. Come on, Avar, don't take all day. You men, mount up and follow me. There's work to be done. Horse time? I should have seen this coming. I should have known he would come for the weakest of us. You opened a bloody wound when you killed Rodri's brother. Anything worth doing must be paid for in blood. In Quadford, you told me Rodri gave you that scar on your face. Is it a story worth telling? It's not worth telling, it is worth remembering. Years ago, I was headed back from the Western Isle. They have got fighters there. I had taken a bit of a beat. Put me in a surly mood. I wanted blood and silver, nothing more. So, me and my drangir sailing along the coast of Camry, see a nice spot for landing, covered in mist. We drag our ships ashore. And just then, a cry came from atop a hillock. The troll cursed Britons. The fog clears a bit. And there they are. All lined up. The biggest one calls out. I am Rodri, king of this land. That means shit to me. I scream back. I give my boys a nod. And we raise up our axes and charge before they take a breath. We have the numbers. But the Britons are clever. It's marshland. The bog catches our boots, sucks us to a standstill. One by one. Rodri. Cuts us to bits. He gets to me, lays his blade at my cheek, and gives me this nick. Leave this land and give your people fair warning, he says. Tell them King Rodri gave you that cut. And shit, I say. Rodri laughs and lets me go. Quite a story, Ivar. Son of Ragnar, killer of kings, conqueror of England and the Western Isles. You have lived the saga worth ten. That I have. All right, let's get into it. That Could be the last bits of it. Slug is just beyond those walls. May only be defeated by a dragon. My itching ass. He'll meet one, all right. Send a message to your men. We can build a camp here and lay plans for a surprise attack. Ivar's men waste no time. They are eager to pay out our revenge. Okay, let's speak to Ivar and get his last bit of this mission done, I reckon. I don't think it'll take too long. I am ready. What in the name of Loki have you done? Called in the dragon to help me slay Rodri. <laughs> Now what say you, Wolfkist? Are you ready for war? Rally the men, Ivar. Let's have at it. It is a good day to die. The gate looks to be well defended. My men are loading a cart with cauldrons of oil. We will blast right through that fucking gate. I think mean, Ivar's my favourite character in this. He's so good. Storm the gates, let's do this. Rodri! Show yourself! I am here, boneless Ragnarsson. How is it you come in force when our peace has been concluded? Do not mock us, whore son! You splattered blood on our peace with the butchery of young Chalbert! Speak what nonsense you please, Dane! If you mean war, our defenses are sure. 
gaze upon my face, King of Grow Food, and meet the dragon that will devour you. I see a spent old man playing at serpents. Enough talking, Nivar. Bring the oil cart and set the fires! When I am done with Rodri, I will tear the fat from his shanks and use it to fry our bread. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Get the cart, boys! We will light it up in front of the gate! Ha. Let's hit! Spare get the wagon brains. to the gate! They've sent the coming! I will wash the castle walls with Rodri's blood! Shield! Arrows coming! Shield! Oh, how many arrows have we got? Get behind this cat! Jesus, guide my blows! Look out! Shields up! Time to die! Take cover! Incoming arrows! Let's get it going. Get rid of these dudes and we can hopefully Run from me. What? How did that get me? There's no way that got me. That's stupid. Absolutely stupid. Cart, boys. Right, let's go. We will light it up in front of the gate. Get the wagon to the gate. Too easy. They've sent soldiers to stop our cart. I will watch the castle wall. Get off me! Jesus Christ! Come push it. I thought you actually give me something to light these up for.
Oh, okay. Nice, let's do this. Let's do this, this, this. I need some healing stuff, so otherwise it's going to be quite hard. Speaking of that, here we go. How dare you get off me? Here we go. Give me some arrows. But that's about that as well. Thank you. Can I have some of that? Some of that. Here you. How dare you? Uh, I swear the jars blasting through the gates. We need some jars by the looks of it. <coughs> Give me some jars. No one hit me because I wasn't going to die. Mongrel. Some over here. Don't hit me. Oh, wrong button. Sorry. I pressed the wrong button. Nice. Oh, can we sort out? There we go. Where do we need to go, huh? Shoot the links below the drawbridge. Get out of my way. Get rid of these because they're out of my way, then we can go for the big dude. Oh, get off me.
He did. Stomp on you. This is getting messy, this is. Oh, you sneaky son of a... Don't like you just sitting there. Are they just coming out of here just out of nowhere? I don't appreciate you just turning up behind me out of nowhere. Let you. Let you, let you. Why do you aim for me all the time? So many arrows. Oh, get off me. Why is it just some random person just screaming for like non stop? Right. I need to shoot these bad boys over here. Good skills to be fair. Oh, he's been knocked off the side. Wow, I was prepared to try and kill him. Oh, get off me. He is hiding behind that door. Remember, force it open. Let's go. Ivar the boneless. Huh. You make a pitiful dragon. <laughs> How does Eva die or does he stay alive? That is the question. Well, how does that work? Bastard kicked me in the liver. <laughs> I need some fresh air. Did you kill him just like that? That was mad. Jesus. That was a, a little bit a little bit mad, to be honest. How has he gone flames and just survived? He's not dead. No. 
I have something else planned. Spectacle, remember? He's nothing now but a sad sack of flesh. Kill him and be done with it. Oh no. This will be good. I have something specific in mind. A place and a method. Come. All right. Let's get this over with. Load this lump I wasn't going to let him live because he killed Chabot, so he needs to die. Take care he stays alive. Abel, do not forget that load of rotten flesh called Rotary. Oh. Put you down for a minute. Oh, upgrade, yes. We'll have that, thank you. Come on, let's go. Might be a longer episode this one, but get it all done. One less thing to sort out next time. Might as well conclude it all here, I'd say. Where are we going? An overlook I found while scouting. A view, one fit for a dying king. There's no need for spectacle, Ivar. Let the man die with honor. No, oh, no, no. He must die with style. <laughs> Do I get a horse at least? Come on in. Stay sharp. <laughs> How are you doing, dear king? Stay with us. You must not miss what is coming. There's a lot of dead bodies around, isn't there? Jesus. I killed King Ella, King Osbard, King Edmund, and now King Rodri. Who else can claim such a string of victories? Just finish me. Nope. It is not my place to interfere in this feud. Come on, Eva, where are we going? Hala must look such a sight. Does he breathe still? Barely. Rodri, are you listening? For years I wore this scar with shame, nicked by a Briton and left alive. I tried to cover it with a beard, a cloak. But as your fame grew, I began to beam with pride. A king gave me this mark. What say you to this, Rodri? Huh? Speak up, you old bag of sweat and grease. Manstone rock, huh? Here we are. Bring him close. Come on, him. Go. Just stand there. Hold him up there to the top and keep him breathing. Finish this quickly, Ivar. See here? A 
hungry blade. Now comes the dragon to feed on his favorite meal. The blood eagle. Ivar, is this? The birth of a blood eagle is a sight to be oh. old, my friend. First, I slice the length of your spine. Damn. I think we've seen this before somewhere. I can't remember what it was. In like a show or something. That is a Norseman. The true essence of old heroes. The Blood Eagle has no true meaning for Ivar. He is doing it simply to take pleasure in suffering. Now, I pull back the flesh. The method will always outlive the meaning. Few in time will care why this man died, but the how, that is a song for the ages. <sighs> the fog between good and evil grows thick over time, but glory never fades. There is nothing glorious here. Life is not pretty. It is a bloody fight. Out come the lungs, and we spread them like wings. Oh, that must be a horrible way to die. All of Mercia can see him now. I have seen enough. We are not finished. Eivor, this saga we have written together, it needs an ending, here and now. It is ended, Eivor. I'm done with this place. A fight to the death, you and me. If I win, I am the greatest Vikinger who ever lived. If I lose, what a tale you have to tell. You are battle drunk, Eivor. Goodbye. Poor Chelbert. He barely said a word. Oh, God. I pushed that dragon dagger into his heart. No. Just a soft little squeal. Then, nothing. You sick, cursed fuck out! <laughs> the things a man must do. The trials one must face. The friends one must betray. To achieve... One's destiny, and become king killer forevermore. Traitor, Jailbird was like a son to me. Yes, yes. So fight me, Wolfkiss, to a glorious death. To fight high above the world, Valhalla awaits. Warming up. How good will it feel when all is a fire? Watch out! <laughs> Sense of menace. When I stabbed Goriad, you winced. You cower in the face of sudden drama. It's so quick and ridiculous. You're not so smart. Should have done that again. Should not be doing that. Jailbird! Uh. 
Hold a moment, Eivor. Let me ask you something. Speak then, or I take your tongue. Will you see your father in Valhalla, Wolfkist? Or is the cow oh, in Helheim God. weeping tears of ice? Gold again! Watch out! Oh, you don't. Come on. Bleed like jailbird. Do not shame me, Eivor. Finish me well. <laughs> What? Get up. Bleed like jailbird. Done. Jesus, that was a hard fight. Whew. approach <clears throat> my axe Eivor hand me my weapon I'm going to send him to Valhalla Odin may have use for you but this is more than you deserve uh, do not shame him I hear... I hear their wings. Well, I didn't want to do that today. Carry the body to Quadford. We will say our goodbyes there. And send a message to Uber. Tell him his brother is dead. Well. So let's go to Quadford and go there. Because I want to finish all this off first before we actually. Can I fast travel? Let's fast travel to here. I want to get this all done in one episode. So in that way we don't have to do much the next episode. Go straight into another area. Okay. It wasn't bad considering we were 30 power level below for the whole mission. We didn't do too bad, I don't think, actually, to be quite honest. So, not bad at all. We'll go do this last bit, go to Cockford, say goodbye to the people that have died. And go from there. It's been a long episode, but it's been a good episode to be fair. A lot of uh, stuff has happened in this mission, so it's been actually one of my more preferred missions that I've done actually, to be fair. Because it's actually been quite a lot of main storyline, with a lot of main characters. And it's brought stuff to the, uh, to the story. Which is good. It's what we like. Some of them don't, and it's just, I feel like it's filler. It's not really needed, taking over certain towns and things. 
but with uh, this one has actually been like a proper main story which I've enjoyed. Come on, wolf, hurry up. Clouds our victory. Bishop. Uber. Dead at the hands of a Briton. I cannot imagine the shame my brother felt in his final hour. Were it not for this peace. I killed him. You? After peace was made, Eva murdered Jailbelt and pimped the crime on Rotary to get another swing at him. How do you come to know this? He told me himself. I am always one who desires the truth, Eivor. But this... This is a hard thing to hear. Did he die well? He died a fighter, in all his glory. As he wanted then. With Eivor gone, peace and quiet are now possible. That is something. I will console myself for the thought that we will meet again in Valhalla. Axe in hand. You will. For good or ill, he lived life by his own rules. What man can say better? He lived his life at cross purposes. I often found him strange and his actions puzzling. But not all men are meant to be understood. He needs a proper farewell. I will prepare a ship for his funeral pyre. Bishop, send word to Lady Angharat. Say that her husband died by treachery, and that Ivar has paid the price for it. As soon as I am able. Have you heard from King Chaelwulf? I cannot imagine his grief. He is felled by it. Still, he makes plans for this shire. I am to be Elderman here. Therefore, Shiropshire declares herself your friend and ally, and will remain so for the length of my days. I'm grateful, Bishop. God go with you, Eivor, wherever you may lead. Okay. Song. I did that wrong in that part because he had a All tattoo for most of the episode, and now he doesn't. Oh dear. Wind across the water. The battle maidens beat their wings to carry a king to Odin's hall of corpses. Eva gone. Shirapsha, an ally. I should confer with Randry. Okay. That is it. Done. That is the episode done. So that is episode 18. Bit of a longer episode, but we got quite far in where we wanted to go, so that's good to see. And uh, I will leave it there. So, as always, if you do like the episode, please make sure to share, like, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.